Hello and welcome to Games with Lovers. The game is under sale. Lovers is me. Lovers, we're having a pacifist run and we're talking to a flower, except not that flower. You hear a passing conversation. Hmm. If I say my wish, you promise you won't laugh at me. Of course I won't laugh. <coughs> Someday I'd like to climb this mountain we're all buried under. Standing under the sky, looking at the world all around. That's my wish. Hey, you said you wouldn't laugh at it. Sorry, it's just funny. That's my wish too. However, there is a prophecy. I was just told about this prophecy. The angel, the one who has seen the surface. They will return as the underground will go empty. Well, it's empty out or will everyone escape or will everyone be killed? It depends on the choices of you, the player. Yo! Yo, I know I'm not supposed to be here, but... I want to ask you something. Man, I've never had to ask anyone this before. Um, you... you are human, right? <laughs> Man, I knew it. Well, I know it now, I mean. Undyne told me, um... Stay away from that human. So, like, um... I guess that makes us enemies or something? But I kind of stink at that. <laughs> Yo, say something mean so I can hate you. Please. Mm. On the one hand, I want to challenge this kid's view of the world. On the other hand, I badly want to insult him. Oh, let's go. Yes, it's pacifist. No, let's go now. Yo, what? So I have to do it? Here goes nothing. Yo, I... I hate your guts. Man, I... I'm such a turd. I'm... I'm gonna go home now. Poor monster kid. Be sure to trip. Haha, now you're going to die. Wait, that messes up my pacifist run. Yo, wait! Help! I tripped! Hi, I'm dying to meet loafers. Undyne, you were kind of slow on the uptake on saving Monster Kid. Yo, yo dude! If, if you, you, you want to hurt my friend, you're gonna have to get through me first. Aw, oh, I'm proud. Monster Kid standing up to Undyne. She's gone. Yo, you really saved my skin. Guess being enemies was just a nice thought. <laughs> We'll just have to be friends instead. Uh, I don't like you. Man, I should really go home. I bet my parents are worried sick about me. Do not immediately trip again. Later, dude! Lovers made a friend that he didn't want to, but he had to so he could complete the pacifist run. Okay. Are you ready for some shit? Seven. Seven human souls and King Asgore will become a god. Six. That's how many we have collected thus far. Understand? Through your seventh and final soul, this world will be transformed. First, however, as is customary for those who make it this far, I shall tell you the tragic tale of our people. It all started long ago. No. You know what? Screw it! Why should I tell that story when you're about to die? Yeah! Undyne is a fish! You! You're standing in the way of everybody's hopes and dreams! Alpha's history books made me think humans were cool. With their giant robots and flowery swords of women. You'll meet Alphys later, Alphys is... Oh boy. But you? You're just a coward! Hiding behind that kid so you can run away from me again! And let's not forget your wimpy goody two-shoes, shtick! Ooh, I'm making such a difference by hugging random strangers! You know what would be more valuable to everyone? 
If you are dead? That's right, human. Your continued existence is a crime. <coughs> Do you hear yourself right now? Your life is all that stands between us and our freedom. Right now, I can feel everyone's heart pounding together. Everyone's been waiting their whole lives for this moment. But we're not nervous at all. When everyone puts their hearts together, they can't lose. Now, human, let's end this right here, right now. I'll show you how determined monsters can be. Step forward when you're ready. <laughs> I don't know how <laughs> is supposed to sound. In any event, I think if I continue doing that voice, I'm gonna end up like actually puking blood. So just as well I have a full fight up. And the wind is howling, you're filled with determination. <sighs> okay, let's go. That's it then. No more running away. Here I come! I forgot to stock up on health items. Whoops the daisy. We'll see how long I last. This is the green heart, by the way. You told Undyne you didn't want to fight, but nothing happened. As long as you're green, you can't escape! Unless you learn to face danger head on! You won't last a second against me! <coughs> Get it? Smells like sushi. You told Undyne you didn't want to fight. Undyne! I believe the human being and the fish can coexist peacefully! Not bad. I'm going to go for this voice for the sake of my throat. Then how about this? <clears throat> Undyne thinks of her friends and pounds the ground with her fists. You told Undyne you didn't want to fight, but nothing happened. For years we've dreamed of a happy ending. Undyne holds her fist in front of her and shakes her head. Let me just check. Yeah, I, I fucked up. At least I have two HP. Well, at least I have two health items, I mean. And now, sunlight is just within our reach. I won't let you snatch it away from us! Yeah! Enough warming up. Oh boy. Now, you can, once you're green, you can't escape, so once you're red, let's beat this popsicle stand. Ah! You won't get away from me this time. <clears throat> That's how it goes. Honestly, I'm doing you a favor. Undyne points heroically towards the sky. Why? No human has ever made it past Asgore. Undyne towers threateningly. Killing you now is an act of mercy. Oh jeepers. Undyne thinks of her friends and pounds the guns with her fists. Please, no to kill me. So stop being so damn resilient. Ha ha! Let's beat this popsicle stand. Uh, Welk. Welk to you too. You've escaped from me for the last time. I doubt that. Alvis told me that humans were determined. I see now what she meant by that. I'm an exceptionally determined human. Please in game, but I'm determined too. Oh geez, this is all confusing. Let's drink some of that CT. Speed boost, your recovery is 10 HP. Determined to end this right now! Oh jeepers. Undyne draws her finger against her neck just to make the point clearer. Right now! Oh, cheekers. Let's drink some tea. You drink the sea tea, your speed boost, you recover 10 HP. Right now! Oh, 
Oh jeepers. Sounds like flip your spear impatiently. I'm out of items. Better plead for our lives. Huh. Huh. That's the best I could do with that, sorry. I got confused, sorry. Yeah! Die already, you little brat! Oh jeez, I'm confused, sorry. I don't think I'm gonna make it out of this one. Let's run away. Welcome to... Oh, I'm getting a phone call, hang on a moment. Hey, what's up? I was just thinking. You, me, and Undyne should all hang out sometime. I think you was make great... I think you was make great pals. Let's meet up at her house later. What a great idea. Ah, uh, I made it. Ha, <laughs> she's mad. Oh, Sans. Hey, I think I did it. <clears throat> Armor, so hot. But I can't give up. Oh, poor Undyne. It's a water cooler. Take a cup of water? Yes. You take a cup of water. Get rid of the water? Yes. You pour the water on the ground next to the water cooler. It's a water cooler. Take a cup of water? Yes. You take a cup of water. Get rid of the water? Yes. You pour the water on the ground next to the water cooler. It's a water cooler. Take a cup of water? Yes. You take a cup of water. Get rid of the water? Yes, you pour the water on the ground next to the water cooler. Let's stop fucking around. This is the pacifist route. Let's take a cup of water. Give it to Undyne. Give Undyne the water? Yes. Just pour it on her face. She has to go do some soul searching. God bless. On that nice note, we're gonna call it there for this episode of Games with Loafers. The game has been Undertale, the Loafers has been me, Loafers. Be sure to dislike this video if you hate this, leave your thoughts in the comments above, and click the subscribe button wherever it is this year. Thanks. Love you. Mwah.